Before starting your trimmer engine, inspect the unit. Replace any damaged parts. Make sure all fasteners are in place and secure. Use only the flexible, non-metallic line recommended by Husqvarna. Never use wire or rope, which can break off and become a dangerous projectile. Check that the trimmer head and trimmer guard are not damaged or cracked. Replace the trimmer head or trimmer guard if they have been exposed to impact or are cracked. Never use the machine without a guard or with a defective guard. An unbalanced trimmer head induces heavy vibrations that may damage the machine. When starting a cold engine, press the purge bulb seven times until fuel begins to fill the bulb. The purge bulb does not need to be completely filled. Move the blue engine choke lever to the closed position. When starting the engine, Hold the body of the machine on the ground using your left hand. Do not use your foot. Firmly grip the starter rope handle with your right hand. Do not squeeze the throttle trigger. Slowly pull the cord until you feel some resistance, then quickly and powerfully pull the cord about 12 to 14 inches. Do not pull the starter cord all the way out and do not let go of the starter handle when the cord is fully extended. This can damage the machine. Never wrap the starter cord around your hand when starting the engine. Pull the cord until you feel some resistance. Repeat pulling the cord until the engine attempts to start. Move the blue engine choke lever to the half-closed position. Pull the starter rope until the engine runs. Move the blue engine choke lever to the open position. If the engine dies, return the blue engine choke lever to the closed position and repeat the starting steps. To start a warm engine, move the blue engine choke lever to the half position. Pull the starter rope until the engine runs. Move the blue engine choke lever to the open position. Stop the engine by pushing the stop switch in the stop position until the engine stops.